Hello and welcome to another stream by Noobs Gaming. Hello and welcome to another stream by Noobs Gaming. Today we're doing a Costco tin. We're seeing if we can make our money back on the tin. So the lo a lot of the local Costco's, I'm seeing it on the groups on Pokemon and stuff, have come out with these tins. There's three of them. There's three packs in each tin, and they include an Evolving Skies pack, a Brilliant Stars, and a Fusion Strike. A lot of good packs. The Evolving Skies packs market for like seven dollars and twenty cents or ten cents or something right now alone. So they alone pay for the cost of the tin um, unopened. So let's see what we can get off of this. Full disclosure, I already uh, opened one of these tins and I actually pulled my first evolution. So that was pretty cool. Let's see, okay. They're kind of a pain to get into. Double wrapped. Okay, so we've got our first tin here. Let's move these aside. So they come in. It's nice when they're on the side like that, too, with these tins being taller. They're not jammed in there where you're going to get the bent cards. Like they were just sitting. Show you in like that. And then you've got the coin. And from what I can tell, they're all the same coin every time. And then we've got our brilliant. Oh, this that's interesting. Has two brilliant stars. I'm already getting scammed. <laughs> Okay, the whole the other tin it had three of each pack. It had evolving skies, one brilliant stars, and one fusion strike. But you know, maybe not. Let's see what we're getting there. Okay, there's a code card for y'all. Okay, let's see. One, two, three, four. All right, fighting energy, Sharpedo, Heliosk, Dunsparce, Growlithe. The Lynx, more Petco, Smeargle. We got the Reverse Holo Landorus, and we got Rare Holo Blissey. Okay. So, nothing too good there. What's up, Pokethug? Shout outs to Pokethug in the comments there. Here's another code card. He's in Florida, or soon to be doing packs out there. Make sure to check out his channel. We got Choice Bell, Luxio, Magmar, Staryu, Burmy, Salk, Reverse Hollow Piplup, and a Hollow Lucario. Okay. That's probably like 30 cents. Not doing the best right now. No. <laughs> but hey, it's a. Hollow at least. All right, let's see. Can we get that radiant Charizard? Not radiant. Uh, Rainbow Hollow. All right, code card, brilliant stars. Let's see. I think we got a water energy. No oh, steel. Okay. Let's see what we got here. Luxio, Hitmontop, Sock, Magmar, Staryu, Burmy, and oh. Sylveon, <laughs> Trainer Gallery, dope, sick, and then a Muck. Maybe Pokethug can uh, look up our Sylveon V Trainer Gallery, see what the worth is on that. That's a nice card, though. I really like that. Who thought we'd get an Evolutions, but not out of the Evolving Skies? <laughs> we got it out of the Brilliant Stars. That's dope. All right. All right, let's open up the water based one. Shout outs to the Lapras OG. Okay, so these are 
I expect them to be kind of the same. Well, these tins are kind of loud, huh? Okay, so look in there. Kind of the same thing. Okay, got the coin. And we've got, of all these guys this time, that's how it should be. That's how all of mine were on the other pack. Okay. We'll look up the price of the pulls at the end here. Start with our Brilliant Stars. This is a great set. Here's a code card. We got one, two, three, four. Got the V-Star. These are great dividers for your bulk set in the boxes. You use those little V's as dividers. Fairy, Salk, Sakatuya, Corefish, Golette, Star Raptor, Reverse Hollow, Yiskyu. Okay. And the Gimp. And let's see. Fusion Strike code card, upside down. Okay, there you go. One, two, three, four. Let's see. There's the water energy. We got Lopani, Hariyama, Berloom, Felinx, Morpeko, Smeargle, Quailfish, Macargo, Hollow Grimmsnarl. Okay, not bad. All right, Evolving Skies, baby. Let's go. All right. Big money, big money. Okay. Evolving Skies code card. That's worth something there. One, two, three, four. What do you think? Fighting energy? Okay, nope. Dark energy. All right, let's see what we got here. Boldor. Another Boldor. <laughs> Nuzleaf. Bergmite. Drowsy. Scraggy, Bag on, Woobat, Reverse Hollow, Hair Deer, I don't know, a Drompa, that's a cool art though, I like that. Alright, no luck out of that tin. We did get that Grim Snarl. Alright, now we got the electric tin. Got everybody's favorite with the Pika there. And these are only 22 bucks at Costco. The last one I opened up did have three packs of all of Evolving Skies, and I did actually pull an Umbreon full art. Just sick. That thing paid for the cost of it itself. Okay, so we got our three packs correct this time. Uh, we'll do the Evolving Skies last. Let's go view Fusion Strike. The way we can pull that Gengar VMAX on the art there. Whoop! That was a close cut. Okay. Code card. One, two, three, four. Alright. Dark Energy, Metapod, Battle VIP, Croconaut, Corsola, Quailfish, Veld, Pix, Chansey, Zigzagoon. We got a Reverse Hall of Simipore, and a Levani. And then, all right, next pack, here we go. Let's see, we got the Evolving Skies. Can we get another alt art, or a trainer gallery? Actually, I haven't pulled an alt art yet. But those evolutions in these are pretty cool, and I opened up a ton of Brilliant Stars. Didn't get any of the evolution trainer galleries. One, two, three, four. All right. Try not to give you guys any peaks there on whether we not we got a hit or not. Suck, Corefish, Golette, Grimer, Electivire was the rare. I skipped one. All right, big money, big money. All these cut better upside down. Okay. All right, last code card. We got Evolving Skies. One, two, three, four. Make it nice and tight. Okay. We got Fighting Energy, Moon Sun Badge, Toy Catcher, Powdown, 
Psyduck, Swap Blue, C Dot, Woobat. We got a Reverse Hall Hitmonchan, which is actually dope. Oh, that's a really cool card, though. Galarian Moltres and a Rare Hollow. Very cool. Very cool. I like that. Okay. So. We pulled. We did three tens. And we pulled four total hits there. With the Sylveon being the money. Let's just pull that up real quick. I think we might have made our money. Definitely if we would have got that third Evolving Skies pack. Let's see what that unrated is. Okay, unrated about 15 bucks. Not bad. And we, I actually just want this card for my collection, so I'm pretty happy with this pull. If we look at it, it's actually pretty centered. Not bad. If you look at the lines on the sides, they all look pretty even. It's kind of hard to tell on camera versus in person. So that could be a good one to send in to get rated eventually. All right, everybody. So I would say unrated 15 bucks. We came out about five bucks under with the, the rare hollows being probably, uh, you know, quarter to 50 cents. But we'll be doing some more like this. Uh, check out Poke Thug's channel. He's doing some cool videos as well. This is where I kind of got the idea. Um, but yeah, have a good one. And again, like and subscribe.